Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I will be showing you a Miniso haul. So uh, I picked up a lot of items from Miniso and since Miniso is a very budget friendly brand, they all cost me less than 2000 Indian rupees. So if you don't know, Miniso is a Japan based brand that sells a lot of homeware and utility products, makeup products and accessories and also some basic clothing items and bags and other uh, knickknacks. So keep watching if you want to know what I've bought. So the first product I picked up is the Miniso LCD alarm clock. So this is a black digital alarm clock which also shows the temperature, the humidity percentage, the date and the uh, day. So let me open this. It comes in a packaging like so. And this is what it looks like here. There are some buttons to set it up to adjust the timing and also to press the alarm clock and this is going to light up the screen and make the digits more visible. This runs on two AAA batteries. The batteries do not come with the product. This product is just the alarm clock alone so you'll have to purchase the battery separately. This was a pretty handy product for my study table. I picked this up because it was very compact and I've never really had an LCD watch on my table before. So it is going to make my study table look a little better. So this was priced at 490 rupees. The next product I bought was a coffee mug. So this is a ceramic or marble coffee mug. It is pink in color. This was actually on a discount. So I got a 10% discount when I bought this. So I recently broke one of my mugs. So I was excited to look for another one. And this is very plain and simple. And this is also microwave safe. So this is a simple solid color and it is microwave safe, yes. So this cost me 190 bucks and there was a 10% discount on this. The next product I bought is sanitary napkin packet. So this has 10 pieces and it sells for 90 rupees. I really like Miniso sanitary napkins. I've used them before also and they are very soft and they're cotton based. They're not synthetic or nylon based so they do not cause any rashes or irritation. They're really comfortable to wear. I picked it up in the largest size there was which is 290 millimeters. So uh, they're very affordable in my opinion. Other brands cost a little bit more and uh, these are made out of cotton and they're gentle on the skin, absorbent and breathable. I highly recommend you try out Miniso sanitary napkins if you have not already. They are going to be very good if you have sensitive skin and you are rash prone. The next product I picked up was a set of razors. These are disposable razors. There are four of them. Uh, Miniso sells very good accessories like this as, at a very affordable price point. So this pack cost me only 150 rupees and uh, they also have an aloe vera strip so they are going to be uh, good for the skin, it's going to be moisturizing and it also contains vitamin E. I've used Miniso razors before, they do have a more or less long life. You also get razors where you can change the razor head as well but I prefer using the disposable razor, razors because uh, I can try out different uh, blades and uh, it is convenient for using. So I highly recommend you check out other Miniso accessories. They send eyelash curlers and makeup brushes. So razors I highly recommend. The next thing I picked up was uh, cotton pads. These are very essential for any person who uses makeup or toner. So this is uh, 150 rupees and there are uh, 180 sheets so these are cotton pads and they are very good quality they're very soft and they are very gentle on your skin especially if you use micellar water for clearing your makeup then i highly recommend you invest in your cotton pads if you use a synthetic or a low quality cotton pad they can cause rash and irritation and, and when you apply it on your skin it can feel very rough but this is very nice and smooth and it is also very absorbent so if you put a little bit of micellar water 
sandal on the cotton pad it does not leak or it does not fall all over your dress so this is very good i highly recommend this they come in a few different colors i think they come in the plain white color but i chose the pink color which is pink is my favorite i actually went into miniso to look for one product in particular and then i ended up buying nine so the first thing that i wanted to buy from miniso is this desktop mirror so this is a standing mirror and it comes with a little bit of storage actually this was not the one that i was looking for i leave a link in the description box below for the product that i actually wanted it is just the plain desktop mirror with no storage and it is also in silver color but i could not get that it was out of stock so i got only this one it has a stand where you can hang a little bit of jewelry and it has some storage below and it is white in color and made out of plastic So this is the base of the product and this is the stand so you can set it up like so yes so here you can basically hang the jewelry and everything and this is what the mirror looks like it is pretty big they did have it on display so i had the idea what the size was before i bought it so it is pretty big and it does come with storage this was uh, a good purchase for 350 bucks i think it is pretty sturdy but if you assemble and disassemble it a lot i don't know how long it will last but now it feels pretty stable and sturdy so you can put your knickknacks on it and this is a very good quality mirror the face looks very nice one is zoomed in and the other is a little bit zoomed out. So I highly recommend this product but uh, I, if you want something that is a little more classy and less plastic, I will leave a link in the description box below for that product that I was actually looking for. In fact, I leave a link to all the products that I could find online for Miniso so that you can check them out later. The next two products I picked up were hair brushes. So I think Miniso sells a very good variety of hair brushes. You get one which are foldables, you get various different combs that are static free. I highly recommend you try them out. They have massager brushes, they have thin brushes, they have brushes with different bristle size. Depending on your hair type, I'm sure you'll get something that suits you. So these brushes had a very good price point. They're a little dirty because I've used them a couple of times already. So uh, again, this was not exactly the brush that I was looking for. I was looking for the brush with a uh, silver mirror-like finish and I did not get it because they were out of stock so I went with this one because the bristles were more or less the same so this is a paddle brush I think it cost me around 200 bucks and this was this uh, this is a static free rubber comb so this when you comb your hair really smooths it out and does not generate any static that leaves your hair looking frizzy and this was for 190 rupees so these are very good products that I use on a daily basis and Miniso has a wide variety of these so I suggest you can go to a store and check it out. The next product that I picked up were two uh, face masks. So face masks are very popular Korean uh, products. So I, you can check out Nykaa, there are so many different brands selling face masks. I usually do not buy face masks from any random brand but Miniso this time I saw had a lot of stock and they had a lot of variety and I was tempted to pick out two of these uh, face masks. They contain pure essential oil and they are called the Hydrolat. Uh, they have the lavender which is a skin refining mask and the orange blossom which is the intensive revitalizing mask. So the orange blossom one is for moisture and glow and the skin refining one is for youthful and radiant skin. It contains lavender. So I'm very excited to try one of these products and see how it works. If it is good, then I will definitely repurchase. This retails for uh, 60 bucks, I think. Yes, 60 bucks. This retails for 60 rupees. And the last product I have to show you for this haul is a beauty blender. So uh, Miniso sells a great variety of makeup accessories. They have brush cleaners. They have a good variety of brushes. They have mermaid uh, handle brushes. And they have a lot of variety of makeup sponges and beauty blenders. So I chose to pick up this one because it comes in a sort of a triangular uh, shape. Oh, this will be difficult to open. So this is what it looks like open. It 
is pretty soft and absorbent. I've used their beauty blender before. It comes in the typical normal beauty blender shape, but this is slightly different and I think it is going to be easier to apply makeup using this different shape. So you can really go into your eye creases and pat it down around the mouth. So the shape I feel is very convenient. And they have a few other shapes. They also have beauty blenders where you have a stand and you can keep it on your dressing table in that stand. But I chose to go with this one and let's see how it turns out. This retails for 230 rupees. There have some other varieties in color. I chose to go with the pink color. If you're looking for good makeup accessories, please check out their range. They have a lot of uh, makeup accessories that can interest you. Their eyelash colors are also very good. I have one, but I broke it because I dropped it. So I cannot show it to you now. So highly recommend a beauty blender. So those are the nine products that I picked up from Melissa Hall. I hope you got some useful tips and insights and please do check out their store if you don't already know about the brand. They have a lot of interesting products and if you're looking for some of the things that I have bought, I have left links in the description box below. Please check them out if you're interested. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video, please leave a comment below as to what product you would like to buy the most and subscribe to my channel for more content. Until the next video, bye. Thank you.